What's up guys, Jason here with feelawesomecompany.com and in this video I'm going to go over the importance of magnesium when it comes to insulin resistance and diabetes. And so the first thing is that magnesium's involved in insulin secretion and what it does is it helps your body to sense when glucose increases and then it kind of acts like a thermostat in determining when and how much insulin uh, needs to be released in order to compensate for this. Now, magnesium is also required for the enzymatic reactions that convert glucose into ATP, which is your uh, usable energy source. And so if your magnesium levels are low, you're just not gonna release the proper amount of insulin and this can lead to having increased blood sugar levels, insulin resistance, and eventually diabetes. Now, magnesium uh, also helps to promote insulin sensitivity. And so uh, what it does is it helps your body to bind insulin to uh, different insulin receptors and also uh, activates different insulin signaling pathways, which uh, play a role in most metabolic actions uh, throughout your body and so if you don't have enough magnesium uh, this these areas just aren't going to work properly and it can worsen insulin resistance and even cause uh, metabolic disorders now magnesium also helps with inflammation and can uh, reduce uh, various pro-inflammatory molecules that can uh, reduce antioxidant activity. And this can lead to uh, excessive oxidative stress, uh, which can uh, lead to further inflammation, which can also uh, worsen your insulin uh, resistance. Now, if you currently have diabetes or even just moderate insulin resistance, then you have an even greater need for a higher magnesium intake because if you have insulin resistance, this uh, reduces magnesium uptake into your cells and having low intracellular magnesium makes insulin resistance worse. So. Basically, if you have insulin resistance, this lowers your magnesium, and having lower magnesium worsens your insulin resistance. So this can create a very negative uh, downward spiral that you need to take action on. You need to increase your magnesium intake if you want to improve on this. Now, if you want to learn more about magnesium and other related topics, check out my other videos on this channel. And I hope you found this helpful, and if you did, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. And then I will see you in the next video. Peace.